Put the Krogan down hard if they tried anything. You won't earn trust with tactics like that. But right now, we focus on disarming that bomb. Yes, but Cerberus found it. Detonation means all-out war between my people and the Krogan. Right. Where is it? Those buildings ahead. Cerberus brought equipment to dig it up. The 9th Platoon will cover your flight, Commander. With all this activity, the Krogan have to know something's up. Then we can't fail, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant.
copy that. No trigger, no explosion. Defeat the Krogan and then plant a bomb on their planet. Pretty extreme, but those were desperate times. They did what they had to. Maybe the Turians have more in common with us than I thought. I don't know if that's a compliment or not. Cerberus is putting up a fight, but the 9th platoon is advancing, Commander. Good work, Lieutenant. Objective acquired.
thing's gonna do some damage. How the hell they hide that? It must have been far enough underground to stay hidden. Cerberus had to dig it out. I hope Victus knows what he's doing. We won't get a second chance. We gotta move, Shepard. Commander, we're entering the bomb site. Moving towards the control station. We're closing on those systems. They'll be swarming out any minute now. Agreed. Then all of it thanks to my people. Damn it. to slow us down. I need to create a bypass. That'll take time. But like you said, no trigger, no explosion. Are you sure you can disarm the trigger? Yes, it's old tech. I know what to do. Buy me a few minutes, Commander. We'll make sure you have the time you need, Lieutenant. Understood. Starting bypass. And thank you for making sure I get this chance. Just make it right, soldier. Damn it! Commander! Focus on the bomb. We'll handle Cerberus. Nobody gets past us. Clear? Understood! We've got company! Trigger mechanism. It's set to detonate. Disarm it. No time. I have to separate the trigger from the bomb. Now. Cover me.
radio chatter coming in from Krogan Force's planet side? Sounds like they started sweeping out the remaining Cerberus troops. Hate to be the guy who told the Krogan about that surprise package. Did you get out all right? Sounds like it got ugly down there. The Turians took a lot of casualties, Joker. The Primarch's son included. Understood, Commander. Joker out. He never hesitated. Whatever he was before, he'll be remembered for this. What will the Turians think about this, Garrus? Hard to say. Sacrifice and more is expected. He did us proud, but we're a hard bunch to please. Living your life for the cause. Society first, platoon first. It's all just expected. He did what he had to do when it counted. Yes. Yes, he did. Good work on Tachunka, Commander. Stopping that bomb prevented the war between the Turians and the Krogan. We can't afford that kind of division right now. Joker said the Krogan are recovering the bomb. They moved in, won't allow Turians to send in recovery crews to help. Understandable. The situation is fragile at the moment. With Reeve and the Primarch aboard the Normandy, you've got a situation brewing. We don't have a solid alliance between those two yet. Keep the peace, Commander. That's an order. Yes, sir. Pack it out. We couldn't risk another galactic war with the Krogan. The Genophage wasn't enough? You needed another way to keep your pets chained? The decision was made hundreds of years ago. So much has changed. You still didn't tell us about the bomb, coward. Hey! We can't let the past rip us apart. Working together, we have a chance. Primarch, you had a bomb on Tachunka. And Reeve, in the Turian's place, you would have done the same damn thing. Commander... It's over! His own son died today, making this right. Please, Commander. It's all right. All right, Commander, I agree. We have stronger enemies to face. We do. <clears throat> I understand your reservations before, Commander. But I hope you now understand the secrecy. Secrets get people killed. You've learned that the hard way. Yes. The hardest lesson I'm ever to learn, Commander. My son, he died with the respect of his men. I wanted to thank you for that. His sacrifice will be recorded in the histories of the Ninth Platoon. Something any father would be proud of. Yes, sir. I'm about to call this whole deal off, Shepard. I knew the Turians had it in for us. Just bear with me, Reeve. Nobody said this would be easy. Easy? You don't have a genophage hanging over your head. Or a bomb ready to blow up half your planet. Krogan have never had it easy. I understand. You better. Now, do you need something? Let's get back to work. <clears throat> something wrong? That Solarian scientist of yours. He failed to mention how he was going to take his tissue sample. This ship doesn't have enough painkillers for where he cut me. Again, Commander, thank you for ensuring my son died with honor. It's all a Turian father can hope for. But this is war. The time for mourning is later. Is there something you need? That's all. Of course, Commander.
Look to take it to the landing coordinates. Joker, what have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're gonna be able to land a shuttle there. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, sir. New form of Reaper, Shepard. Using Shroud to poison Tuchanka's atmosphere. Problematic. Cowards! They're afraid to take us head on! Primark, we're gonna need your help. That could be difficult. Our losses on Palavin have been catastrophic. We're doing this for Palavin. No one said it would be easy. What do you have in mind? A combined attack. Your people hit the Reaper with an airstrike. Reeve, at the same time, your soldiers will be attacking from the ground. Together, you can draw it away from the tower. Yes, distraction. Small team can reach Shroud facility, finish synthesizing cure. We'll need Eve to come with us. We've never faced a Reaper up close like this. Everyone on board? If you want our help, you'd better be. Dalatrus? Commander Shepard, we know you've reached Tuchanka. And by now, I imagine Morden Solus has proposed using the Shroud. Are you spying on us? Hardly. The Shroud is the only viable course of action open to you. Commander, you can't allow your misguided sympathy for the Krogan to cloud your judgment. Do you honestly believe curing the Genophage will end in lasting peace? We have to give the Krogan that chance. You can't condemn an entire race to extinction based on what might happen. What will happen is the Krogan will reproduce out of control. We uplifted them specifically for their violent nature, not their diplomatic skills. Another war is inevitable. What do you want, Dalatras? Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you're planning couldn't be done. Morden will likely detect this malfunction and repair it. But if you ensure that he doesn't, then the cure's viability will be altered just enough so that it fails. No one will notice the change. You mean trick the Krogan? They need not be any the wiser. Let Erdnot Reeve believe you fulfilled your promise. Morden would never stand for that. How you deal with him is up to you, Commander. We can provide you our very best scientists to build the Crucible, and the full support of our fleets. If I sabotage the cure. Think about it, Commander. The choice is yours. I've spoken with the other clans. They're gathering on our sacred meeting ground at the Hollows. We'll rendezvous there and take an armored convoy against the Reaper. After today, Krogan's superiority will be obvious to everyone. Rare opportunity to improve galactic opinion of Krogan. Hope you use it wisely. Commander, you seem troubled. I got a message from the... It's Dragal Tharak. The Reapers are attacking the Hollows. Be ready for a fight! Hang on tight. We're heading in.
Shepard, protect our flank. I'll go pull the other clans out of the fire. Everyone pick your targets and keep an eye on our six. Now move! Watch it, incoming! Switch forward. Don't let him get up here. History will show that Clan Erdnot drew first Reaper blood. No time for bragging. The airstrike is on the way. Female safe, Shepard. Recommend haste, however. Vital signs troubling. Who let the Salarian onto Tachanka? They aren't welcome here. Multiple Krogan. Problematic. Who are you? Jorgal Thorak. Our clan stretches back as long as there have been Krogan. Unlike these Erdnot whelks. <sighs> I own Varen, who are older than any of them. <sighs> Which just means you've been around too long, Tarek. You're weak and tired. And wise enough to know Salarians can't be trusted. The Salarian is not your enemy. He's here to help cure the Genophage. You didn't see what his kind did to our people. You weren't there, human. There will be a reckoning for the Genophage, Tarek. But not until I say so. <laughs> Enough! You can stay here and let old wounds fester as Krogan have always done. Or you can fight the enemy you were born to destroy and win a new future for our children. I choose to fight. Who will join me? I will. And so will the rest of you. <laughs> You're not serious about avenging the genophage, Reeve. <coughs> it would be a disaster for our people. Our people were made for war. It's what they want. And you need to be the leader who tells them they're wrong. Krogan already spread war across galaxy before. Genophage was result. Must learn from that. Otherwise, we'll share fate of ancestors. And would our ancestors forgive their enemies so easily? What were the ancient Krogan like? Tachanka wasn't always a wasteland. In the old times, the Krogan were a proud people. We had dreams, a future to look forward to. Until Salarian interference? No, we destroyed Tachanka ourselves. Technology changed us. It made life too easy. So we looked for new challenges and found them in each other. Nuclear war was inevitable. Maybe, but that didn't give anyone the right to unleash the genophage on us. You'll be caught in a vicious cycle if you try to avenge the Genophage. As long as the rest of the galaxy thinks we want revenge, we'll have power. They'll fear us, the way Krogan were meant to be feared. But what do you really intend to do, Reeve? <laughs> that would be telling. Commander, on the shuttle, was there something you were going to say? The Dalatras tried to cut a secret deal with me. What are you talking about? 
She said they sabotaged the Shroud years ago. The cure won't work unless we fix it. Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you're planning couldn't be done. That backstabbing Pinejack! She didn't think we'd notice? Correctly. Would likely have fooled tests. But familiar with STG work, can adjust. Did not come this far for nothing. You just spared our race another genocide, Commander. And avoided making a sworn enemy of me. Well done. Why are we stopping? Reeve, you and Morton stay with Eve. It's looking ugly out here. Hurry it up. It's dangerous stopping like this. What's going on? Look at that Reaper. The end of the world out there. And remember to bring it back when you're done. Make sure you're always supposed to find a war with us. What's the holdup? Roads out. The convoy can't make it through. Turian Wing Artemek, this is Shepard. We've been delayed. Hold off your attack. Negative, Commander. Our approach is locked. I'll be over here. An airstrike alone won't do it. We have to get in that fight. says that's Cal Ross. That's what's crawling around down here? No kidding. If they gave the thing a name, it must be something special. Looks like the Rachni again. There are bound to be more than just the ones we killed. Reeve, we've got Rachna here. Keep an eye out. I know, we're seeing them too. But all that matters is getting to that shroud. Move it. Looks like light ahead. And now, this is new. Part of Chachanka that isn't rubble. It makes you wonder what the Krogan could have been if they hadn't nuked the place. Reeve, we made it back outside. If you can see the radioactive haze, you're making progress. Check it out. 
Guess the nukes didn't kill all the plants. You're looking at hope, all that's left of it on Tachanka. This is once a world full of beauty. Given a chance, it can be again. Shepard, that Reaper is still disrupting the Shroud. Get out of there and we'll pick you up. We're on it. Love to know how we're going to deal with the Reaper when we get there. Maybe Eve has a point. Curing the kid ahead, we've got movement! And if she's wrong? enjoying this. Heads up! They're back! I'm on it!
losing Kauros. Find a way down, we'll pick you up. Shepard, get in the truck. Direct, watch your back. That Thresher Maw is still out there. Make it fast, Reeve. We're in the open here. Move it. It's Kauros! Move, Shepard! We're in. Go! Your Krogan friend may still be alive. The rat was no friend. Now, let's get moving. We got a Reaper to deal with. I hope somebody has a plan B. I know we've beaten the odds before. But getting to that tower, I don't know. We're not leaving here until the genophage is cured. Then I hope this idea you were talking about is a good one. It's not mine, it's hers. Kalros. We summon her to the Reaper. Would that even work? Already discussed strategy. Just need to distract Reaper. Draw it from power while cure synthesized, released. What makes you so sure she'll come? Legend says <laughs> she is the mother from which all other Thresher Maws spawn. This is as much her home as ours. Every living thing on this planet knows how to kill, and kill well. Her more than most. Well, after everything we've been through, why not? It's just a Thresher Maw. I didn't think a human could have that kind of courage. How would we summon her? The tower was built in an arena devoted to Kalros's glory. The Solarians thought she would scare away intruders. Appears to have worked. There are two Maw Hammers there. <laughs> the largest in existence. If you can activate them, Kalros will come. That should distract the Reaper. Meanwhile, laboratory nearby. We'll finish synthesizing cure. Let's make sure we all get out of here alive. We're gonna have one hell of a story to tell. Shepard, try not to get killed up there. Fight like a Krogan and you'll be fine. I can handle them. Go! See you on the other side. Stay alive, Shepard. We'll have cure ready. Let's get in there! <laughs>
truck. I'll take care of the cure. in two minutes, but Eve dead. What happened? Stress sampling, too intense, too much trauma. Wanted to stop, she refused. Her decision. She did it for her people. Female was stabilizing force for Krogan. Implications of Reeve as lone Krogan leader, problematic. Damn! Control room at top of Shroud Tower, must take elevator up. You're going up there? Yes. Manual access required. Have to counteract STG sabotage. Ensure cure dispersed properly. Morton, this whole thing is coming apart. There's gotta be another way. Remote bypass impossible. STG countermeasures in place. No time to adjust cure for temperature variants. No, no other option. Not coming back. Suggest you get clear. Explosion's likely to be problematic. Morton, no! Shepard, please. Need to do this. Need to see it through. For her. Would have liked to run tests on the seashells. I'm sorry. I'm not. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Fage cured. Krogan free. New beginning. For all of us.
void, we commit her body. In life, this Krogan faced our greatest enemy with rare valor. In death, she has proven a savior to her people. May her courage fan the flames of hope for the future. She is now the true mother of T'Changa. She was Krogan. She made us stronger. That's all any Krogan can hope to achieve. It was a shame about the Pijak, though. Morden. He wouldn't have had it any other way. And I'm sure wherever he is, he's putting in a good word for us. It's too bad he wasn't a Krogan. History can't show that a Solarian cured the Genophage. Then who did? The only Krogan who is left standing. I may end up being more famous than you, Shepard. No matter. You lived up to your word, now I'll do the same. Tell the Turians we're more than happy to come show them how to win a war. The Krogan already killed one Reaper, didn't we? Hell of a thing you just pulled off, Commander. Curing the Genophage? I never thought I'd see the day. Reeve has agreed to help the Turians, Admiral. We should get their full support. I take it that leaves the Solarians out of the equation. The cost of their support was too high, sir. Well, I'll defer to your judgment on that, Commander. Let's hope we don't need them. Hackett, out. Commander, Erdnot Reeve has begun sending troops to Palavan. You kept your end of the bargain, and now I'll keep mine. The Turian hierarchy will stand with humanity against the Reapers. I'm glad we can help each other out. It's the only way we're going to defeat the Reapers. That much is certain. To that end, several dry dock ships are ready to help build the Crucible. Garrus will coordinate them. Yes, sir. And when the time comes to deploy it, the full measure of our fleet will be there for Earth. May the spirits watch over us all. I'll start managing Turian support right away, Shepard. You must be exhausted. Morden dying... it can't be easy. I'll sleep when I'm dead. We both know you need a clear head to win a war. There's no room for mistakes here. You should catch some shut-eye. I'll make sure Joker doesn't launch any suicide missions. Anything happens, you let me know.
It's open. Shepard, there's something you need to hear. All right. Is this a bad time? Thinking of all the lives it took to get us here. That's thanks to the Reapers, not you. Are you thinking about anyone in particular? There's a lot of people back on Earth dying while we gather our strength. They're wondering if we're ever coming back. Friends, family, parents and children. This isn't their fight, but they're buying us time with their lives. You'll spend it wisely. I'd better. Didn't you have something for me? The Solarian Counselor has an urgent matter. Let me guess. She called the comm room? The Council must be taking the Crucible seriously. I'll see you downstairs. Commander. Can I help you, Counselor? Shepard, I want you to understand that I owe my position to you, and is not something that I take lightly. Were it not for you, that weak-minded Counselor Valorn would still be alive, leading the Solarians down the sewage pipe. But now I'm forced to champion a cure for the Genophage. It's like saying we need a hurricane to put out a wildfire. Counselor, Krogan are about to die in droves so your people don't have to. That's your message. Human statesmanship at its finest. Speaking of, I need to talk to you about humanity's representative, Counselor Udina. He's moving vast sums of money. We need to talk about where it's going. From what I can tell, you won't like the news. Come see me next time you're on the Citadel. Ishiel out. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCon. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? What about the extra help we picked up along the way? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Had that female Krogan you rescued survived, she might have rallied more support from the clans, but I'll take what we can get. I'm glad you disabled that mom and Tachunka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support. As it is, we picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. What about Arya's mercenaries? Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. The blood pack will be useful, and violent. Mostly Vorcha, I hear. We'll put the Blue Suns to good use. Intel says Darner Vosk is bringing his men, and that they're gunning for a fight. The Eclipse are providing troops and mechs. When we find a Reaper soft spot, they'll help us hit it. Don't want to know how you got Arya's cooperation, but whatever you did, it was worth it. How about the Solarians? Interesting wrinkle. We've been getting back channel commitments from the strike teams within STG. They're promising to back us. Even after I cured the Genophage? Our intel suggests there are cracks developing between the military and the politicians. These STG guys know the score. They're not gonna jeopardize the entire Solarian Union just because some Delatras didn't get her way. Do you know how the other races are doing against the Reapers? Believe it or not, the Turians and Krogan actually seem to be getting along. Heard not Reeve has deployed troops and they're giving the Reapers a moment of pause. The Solarians are still hanging on to Sirkesh, but the Reapers are starting to breathe down their necks too. What about the Asari? They have to be feeling the heat. The Reapers are moving fast with the obvious intent of taking Thessia. Interestingly, the Reapers are leaving Parnak alone. It's the Yogg homeworld. We saw Yogg back on Sirkesh. Didn't look too happy. Well, if we lose this war, it might be them running the next cycle. It's easy to forget the Reapers don't destroy every species. Just the ones who can threaten them. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out.
not taking down the Reaper? Man, I wish I could have been there. I'm just glad the diplomats are Commander, Admiral Hackett has requested your help with a Cerberus fighter base on Navaria. Look at that galaxy map. Do you know how many strategy games are built from that interface? You play strategy games? A few. Most are too flashy, though. I prefer chess. I have a set made from rose quartz and hematite back home. I like the feel of something solid in my hands. Well, now that I know your weakness, we may have to try a game. <laughs> It'd be more fun than playing Edie. Edie doesn't sweat. You sweat playing chess? Depends on how much fun they're having. Commander. Thank you. 